Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. For today, we will continue our lesson on Mathematics Year 4. The lesson that we are going to learn today is a new topic in Chapter 3 which is money. Where the first subtopic that you will learn today is addition of money ataupun tambah wang. You can refer to page 105 and 106 in your textbook. Okay, now let's look at example number 1 in your textbook page 105. It is about a travel package. As you can see, there are two package, package A and package B. Package A, 7 days and six nights at Tohaku or Maple Leaf or Niku or Tokyo Disneyland and package B is six days and five nights at Kyushu Discovery Tour. The price for package A for adult is 7,800 ringgit and for a child the cost is 5,000 460 ringgit while package B price for adult is 7288 ringgit and for a child is 5100 ringgit now you read the conversation wow this is great father let's go to Disneyland so you know that Disneyland is in package A so the mom said We'll choose package A. The cost for an adult is 7,800 ringgit and it is 5,460 ringgit for a child. We must plan our budget earlier. And father said, that's right, Rani. Our dream holiday will come true. The question is, number one, what is the total cost of package A for two adults and a child. So, for two adults, it will be 7,800 ringgit plus 7,800 ringgit and plus one child which is plus 5,460 ringgit. So, we write this into mathematics sentence. So, you write like this. 7,800 ringgit plus another 7,800 ringgit plus for a child 5,460 ringgit equal unknown ringgit. So, you must find the unknown ringgit here. So, let's solve this addition with standard method. We write again in standard method 7,800 ringgit plus 7,800 ringgit plus 5,460 ringgit. Make sure you arrange the digit in this number by their place value and then underline your answer and do addition starting from digit ones 0 plus 0 plus 0 you get 0 and then 0 plus 0 plus 6 you get 6 8 plus 8 equals 16 16 plus 4, you get 20. 20, like this. And then, 7 plus 7 is 14. 14 plus 2 is 16. 16 plus 5 is 21. So, don't forget to write RM symbol in your answer. So, you will get the answer is 21,060 ringgit. So, you write the answer 
and 60 ringgit and then you can try to answer another question their neighbors Encik Isa and Tuan Azila went for a holiday in Kyushu how much did they pay so you know that Encik Isa and Puan Azila both are adult ataupun kedua-duanya ialah dewasa eh, orang dewasa so you need to refer to package B for Kyushu package which is the price for adult is 7,288 ringgit each so for two adults it will be 7,288 ringgit plus another 7,288 ringgit then you underline your answer then let us calculate 8 plus 8 equals 16 8 plus 8 equals 16 plus 1 17 2 plus 2 is 4 plus 1 is 5 7 plus 7 is 14 and then don't forget to put RM symbol so your answer will be 14,576 ringgit now let's discuss question number 2 the table shows the amount of money in the accounts of Watson's parents. So you can see the table here. Account, Watson mother, and this column is account for Watson father. Watson mother salary is 4,857 ringgit. Her savings is 23,156 ringgit and 75 sin while no trust fund for Watson mother and for Watson father his salary is 6,932 ringgit and 86 sin while his saving is 48,900 ringgit and trust fund is 10,973 ringgit and 42 sen. Look at question A. How much money does Watson mother have? So, you refer to column Watson mother and you need to do addition 4,857 ringgit plus 23,156 ringgit and 75 cent. Okay, now, in addition, better we put the bigger number on the top. Okay, so we put 23,156 ringgit point 75 cent. And then, Arrange the number by their place value. 4,857 ringgit. And then you underline. Okay, make sure both number has the same format. Because of the first number has decimal point, so the other number must follow decimal point. So, you put the decimal point followed by zero, zero. So, like that. So, both numbers have the same format. So, you can do addition. We starting from the most right digit which is 5 plus 0. 5 plus 0 equal 5. 7 plus 0 equal 7 and put down the decimal point 6 plus 7 is 13 5 plus 5 equal 10 10 plus 1 equal 11 8 plus 1 is 9 9 plus 1 is 10 
4 plus 3 is 7, 7 plus 1, 8, and 2. Don't forget to write RM symbol. So you get the final answer, the saving or the money for Watson mother is 28,000. 13 ringgit and 75 sen. Now go to question B. Total up the money of Watson father. So in the table you can see the total of Watson father money is in this area. So you need to total up all three numbers here. So you write the mathematics sentence. 6932 ringgit and 86 sen plus 48900 ringgit plus 10973 ringgit and 42 sen So we write the number in standard method 6932 ringgit and 86 Sen plus forty eight thousand nine hundred ringgit plus ten thousand nine hundred and seven two ringgit and forty two sen. And then put the plus symbol and underline. And make sure all numbers in the same format. You can see 48,900 ringgit is not same format as other two numbers. So you need to put decimal point and zero, zero. Now we add from the most right digit, which is 6 plus 0 plus 2 equal 8. 8 plus 0 plus 4 equal 12. And put the decimal point. 2 plus 3 equal 5. 5 plus 1 equal 6. 3 plus 7 equal 10. 9 plus 9 plus 9 is 27. Plus 1, 28. 6 plus 8, 14. 14 plus 2 is 16. 4 plus 1 plus 1 equal 6. And don't forget to write RM symbol. So you get the final answer. Total money for Watson mother is 66,800 six ringgit and 28 sen. Question number 3. 23,486 ringgit and 50 sen plus unknown equal 67,392 ringgit and 80 sen. You need to find out the unknown here. So, if you feel confused or not sure what operation you want to use, so you can use method simple example or simulation. By using this method, you choose one digit of Mathematics sentence, for example, 5 plus 4 equal 9. Now, 5 will be represent this number, 4 will be represent the unknown, and 9 will be represent the last number. So, the unknown is in digit 4. So, you ask yourself, to get answer 4, 9 and 5, what operation is suitable for both digit? So you know that if you want to get answer for 9 plus subtract 5. So you follow the structure for this question. To get the unknown, 9 here represent with 67,300 
92 ringgit and 80 sen you right we change subtract 5 5 is 23486 ringgit and 50 sen so you write okay like this and then you write this mathematic sentence into standard method 67392 ringgit and 80 sen Substract 23,486 ringgit and 50 cent. So remember, the operation is subtraction. So you subtract 0, subtract 0 equal 0, 8, subtract 5 equal 3. And then put down the decimal point. 2 cannot subtract by 6. So you regroup. 9 will become 8. And 1 tenths convert into 1's will be 10. 10 plus 2 equals 12. 12 subtract 6 equals 6. 8 subtract 8 equals 0. 3 cannot subtract by 4. So you regroup 7. 7 will become 6. 1000 convert it to into 100. You will get 10. 10 plus 3 equal 13. 13 subtract 4 equal 9. 6 subtract 3 equal 3. 6 subtract 2 equal 4. And write RM symbol. So you get answer 43,906 ringgit and 30 sen. I hope all the explanation of the topic addition of money will help you to answer another questions. See you soon. Good luck and bye-bye.